Hello guys, um, today I am making a what's in your bag video. So if you can see, this is my bag. It is, you know, a basic military bag. And it is pretty full. I'm going to start with the front pocket, but it doesn't look like there's anything in the front pocket except for trash, trash, more trash. Okay. First of all, my iPod. Must have. I have all sorts of music on here. Like, crazy shit. I love it. I listen to my music all day on the airplane today. Oh yeah, I was out of town in Oregon. I should have started with that. Um, I was gone for about a month and a half. And, um, yeah, so I listened to this on the plane. Sugar-free apple Werther's. These are amazing. Um... This is going to be a semi-goth, um, what's in my bag. I say semi-goth because I don't have too much gothy stuff in my bag, you know, but whatever. Licorice, uh, salted, salted licorice. These little coins are licorice coins. Um... These I can only find in Oregon, and they're amazing. They're called ice chips. They're made with that one chemical that feels cold in your mouth. And um, they're eggnog flavored, and they're really, really, really good. And they're like little chips, like little, like, chips, like meth, but they're really addictive. Kind of like meth is. <laughs> um, yeah. So, then I have jelly beans. I love jelly beans. My favorite is the pear jelly beans. I have a tail. Um, I've heard goths and furries don't really get along very well, but... I'm a goth furry, so fuck all of you. And I am goth, and all you haters out there trying to say I'm not can go fuck yourselves. Um, because I was goth since I knew what the word meant. So, since before I knew what the word meant, like, seriously. Um, ears, sorry, I was recently at a convention a leash a gauntlet more gauntlets that I bought at the convention I was at um, it was called fairy worlds if you've ever heard of it it's in Oregon it used to be in Eugene but next year it's gonna be in Portland it's so much fun. It's worth the money to get in. It is great. It is absolutely amazing. If you like fairies, darkness, creepy, a go. The opening day is Friday. But if you're really into creep factor, go on Saturday. It's really fun. Okay. Three cartons of cigarettes. Capri's, Pommel's, and Virginia Slim. Um, and us goths may be obsessed with death, but we don't want to smell like death, so that's where I bring in the Tic Tacs. Um... The only colorful thing I own. Um, 
in here, I'm not going to open it or unwrap it or anything, but in here is a uh, jalapeno toffee. I really have a sweet tooth. This is five gum. It's amazing. Um, okay. Now we get into the goth stuff. must have powder I'm almost out of it this is NYC translucent I'd the thing is is it's not I mean it'll make you pale if you have darker skin but if you have light skin like me it makes you paler but it still gives you kind of a pinky flesh tone and it doesn't do the whole white thing it doesn't make your face white um if you really like the white face look you might want to go for something like manic panic bridge and snow or something like that but this is affordable i got mine for like three or four dollars um and it's really, really good. It's just translucent. So you can put it on over any foundation. Um, and it'll make you, like, shade lighter. And what you want to do is you want to press it on. And then dust off the excess with the big fluffy brush. Um, and the next thing is black and gray eyeshadow. I do not ever want to be without this again. I, sorry, I lost it while I was up in Oregon and I didn't think I was going to find it and I was freaking out and I was having to use other things to do my eyes and it made me really mad. Um, but I got it back, so yeah. This is what I call an eyeliner sharpie. It is a felt tip eyeliner and it goes on really smoothly but and it smudges real well. You wouldn't expect it to smudge well, but you want to smudge it while it's wet. Um and it'll smudge really well. Um and it's like any other liquid eyeliner, you know. Um this is I have so many eyeliners like I have eyeliners coming out my ass I swear but the reason this one is in my bag instead of in my makeup kit is because this one doesn't really smudge very well and it's for touch-ups you know like, like doing your waterline real fast or like filling in spots you missed or like when you blot your eye and some comes off, just fill it back in. Um, oh, Lipsticks. This is purple. It's like really, really, really dark purple. And this is a deep reddish color. And it, it's cool because it has a gloss in the bottom. I, like, never use this. It's weird. Um, glosses are too sticky and girly and gross. Um, yet another thing of Tic Tac. Oh, this is a really bright, well, sort of bright. It's like a bloody bright red. Um, it's good for, like, rocker makeup and not much else. And finally, oh, 
This is a lip balm. I don't use it very much. It's chapstick cake batter. So it's just a lip balm. And it has the lid to a bottle rocket on it. Um... For some reason, I have a surgical mask. Don't ask why, I don't know. Um, and finally, yes, no, wait, I have one more thing. Oh, two more things. Stomach medication and black nail polish. You never know when the nail's gonna chip. I'm not wearing black nail polish right now, because I spent the past month in Oregon, and I didn't have any, but yeah. Oh, and now my favorite part, scent. Okay, we're going to start out with the lavender I got while I was in Oregon, and it's almost all gone already. It's like down to here. Um and it's called Edelweiss Lavender because it was made with the white lavender. Um, you're getting glare, I'm sorry. But it smells really good. This is just another lavender. I'm almost out of it. That's why I bought the Edelweiss. Um, but this is just your typical, like, it's probably a mix between, um, Grosso and Spike. Um, this is a scent I made myself. It is... It looks like a potion, I swear. Um, this is Lavender Vanilla. Um, it's easy to make. You just need some lavender oil and some vanilla extract. And it smells better than it sounds, I swear. Um, this, I have no idea what scent it is, but the bottle is darling, and it comes with a little tassel, and it's just so elegant and sweet, and I love it. And, uh, that is that. So... I'm checking to see if there's anything else left in the bag. No? No? That, that's everything. Okay. Bye, guys. Hold on. Bye.